Internet Icon, brought to you by the Yom Yom F Network. We receive thousands of video submissions from all over the United States and Canada. We've narrowed it down to our top 100 finalists who have gathered here at the Los Angeles Center Studios in Hollywood. Our judges will critique each video. Best opening I've seen in a video so far. And eliminate contestants until they narrow it down to their top 10. Three S's on the next round. We'll then compete in a series of challenges with time constraints and specific rules. After each screening, we will eliminate one contestant until we discover the next internet icon. Previously on Internet Icon. Top 10, how are you guys? Are you guys ready? Hey! Oh. That's weird. How much time till you actually get here? I get dragged. Just, I got it. 3.05. Yes. But before we go in, everybody was here at three yep. minus one person. Sorry, Anthony, you are the first top 10 contestant eliminated. I wish all the teams right now the best. Welcome back to Internet Icon. I am Chris Rydell, your illustrious host. So today, our contestants are going to be shooting their ugliest truth vlog. This is where they're going to be comparing two displeasing truths or facts, and they really need to make the audience think which is the ugliest truth. So our judges saw some good videos, but this is a high-level competition, and many of the contestants really need to step up their game if they want to stay here. Why don't we go get yesterday's challenge winners, the Clunes. How you guys doing? Doing pretty good. Pretty good. Right on. Congratulations on winning. Thank you. You guys have a 30 minute head start, as you know. Yeah. You will also have first choice of our wonderful actors. Yes. Okay. First pick of anything in the iconography area. And as you know, you will have exclusive access to the brand spanking new icon suite. Oh, yeah. Which is also history. You are the first ever contestants to be up in that suite. Awesome. Congratulations, you guys. Thank you. Let me yep. introduce you to our wonderful actors. This here is Alex. This is Danielle. Hi. Say hello to Max. Max, Hi, Max. And this is Mark. All right, are you guys ready? Uh -huh. 30 minute head start. Uh -huh. Starts now. Nah. Great, thank you. Go, guys. knew that because we had the 8.30 start time, we didn't have to compete for getting in line, which was a nice, comfortable way to start. This is the Ugly Truth Challenge. We're right. comparing two ugly truths, which one's worse. We have more technology that makes us more connected than ever. However, fewer people than ever actually know the names of their neighbors. Just knowing that we could use the actors we needed and we could just bang those shots out. Cut. Yeah. That's wonderful. Great, great, great. Awesome. Got it. Thank you, actors. Thank you. I think we got all the shots with the actors in maybe like 40 minutes. There is a collaborative vibe. You don't want to, oh yeah, we're just going to take the actors you for don't four hours. What? Yeah. That's ridiculous. Yeah, Woo! We're bringing them back. We're bringing them back. You're good, you're good. I can't believe I got here first again. <laughs> I know, you're like, I was going to be the last here? one here. I thought I was going to be the last one here. I got here at eight. You look very snazzy. Camera. I wish I looked as good as you. That doesn't mean that, doesn't mean that you go film oh, him, just because I say he looks good. <laughs> Things went relatively smoothly for us. We have a hold, he's got a contact production services. Okay. Daryl, we're gonna skip it. Not worth the time. Thank you. He was great. I mean, he knew what he wanted. From the detail we did, have, he wanted us to do an awkward hug. And he knew exactly, like a choreographer, what he wanted it to be like. And they just had a great dynamic together and it was fun. The clunes, amazing. I could tell it immediately because uh, they were so specific, knew exactly what they wanted. Every shot was calculated. And they had the best energy. There was just something about them. They're just wonderful to be around, and I really can't wait to see their video. <laughs> that was awesome. We were very excited to uh, be chosen as the winners of the first challenge, which was exciting and also a relief of some kind. Just, I think, more than anything, happy to make a good impression uh, on the judges with our first challenge. OK, everyone. Five minutes warning to your entrance. Thank you. I'm feeling okay. I have no game plan for today. Uh, it's a vlog challenge. We're just gonna make it up as we go. We have a plan. Problem solving. I mean, we have an idea, but we're we're just gonna kind of go with the flow. I like my idea a lot. I think that uh, I've got a good story to tell, so can't wait to get started. Good morning, guys. How you guys doing? Good. Very well. Good. You guys ready for another action-packed day? Yeah, baby. Well, as you guys know, the Clunes have a 30-minute head start, so you have a lot of catching up to do. 
Uh, remember that your videos have to be shot and edited by 3 p.m. today and turned in. You guys know that everything in the iconography area you have access to, as well as our wonderful actors, except we only have one because the clones have taken the other three. Your mythical mentor, Nick Rydell, please take advantage of him, and I mean take advantage of him. All right, you guys, are you ready? Yeah. Yes. yes. The competition begins now. Go. Today, our challenge was to talk about two ugly truths. It started a little rough because we were disagreeing. You're going a little, a little too wordy. Let's do this okay. a little time. I know what my next thing is. All right. I have to tell him that we need to do a take again or we need to change yeah. position and he refuses yeah, yeah, to do yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It's pretty much like normal the way it is with my brother, which is I just want to kill him all the time. We're not used to vlogging in public. So we're trying to be out and normal, but it's a little, little harder, and especially in a hallway. Come along in. Right. Come into our vlog. Cool. It's cool. Sorry. <laughs> we're just kidding. We're kidding. Yeah. Here at Icon, we like to make everyone feel nice. Today was interesting. Started out the day pretty solid. Not what it looks like. How are you doing? <laughs> Clearly not happy. I usually edit the vlog first before I even do cutaways. To know what to cut where yeah. and where kind of stuff. But today, I'm going to go with a different approach, and I don't know if that's good or bad. Are you doing? Do you need Danny? Am I doing, doing something? I'm doing something. Matthias is just hogging up all my, all my locations. Ask him. Ask him how he sets it. Where are you guys settings at? I've never vlogged before. These guys haven't done it on their own. So today, the video that we're going to show is our first ever. Working things out in the very beginning, we were kind of like just winging it. Yeah, this is the first time we've worked without a clear, concise direction and a clear, concise uh, concept. We didn't even have a script today. We were oh, just wow. kind of wandering around going, what are you going to say? Okay, I'm going to say this and you're going to say that. We had the general idea from the beginning and then we kind of just went with it today and kind of made it up as we went. Okay, we got to do that again. That was really rough. I think we might have been a little too like not caring. Today we like to give you a concept, we have the general topic, and that's it. Okay, so I can't go in there for 10 more minutes. So I'm gonna put all my stuff on the outside as a warning. I'm waiting for the music room. Oh yeah? Who's yeah. in there now? Uh, I think the Shields brothers are in there? No, it's Bad Weather Films. We don't vlog normally. So it's a little different for us, but we kind of made it our own. We tried to play to our strengths. Yeah. <laughs> this is a horrible accent. Yes. Yeah, so do whatever you want. We kind of made it like kind of like a sketch. We came up with characters that we thought were going to save us from vlogging, <laughs> and we'll see what happens. Oh, sick! Thanks, mom. Love you. Okay. <laughs> Love sippy cups. It's kind of retarded. I don't know who's going home, but Will, uh, Watermelon Will, he seemed like he was really struggling. Today was a very slow start to uh, my journey here. I am mostly writing. Like, I'm just walking around, getting the gears going, and I want to write something more, like, from me. I saw a contestant who was spending hours on end walking around writing and writing and writing and not shooting anything. The challenge itself is very difficult. Uh, I wasn't sure if it's supposed to be uh, comedy, heartfelt, or if I'm just supposed to be an idiot. Me being an idiot apparently is what people like. So I thought, you know, today I want to try something different, right? I want to show that uh, I have more to me. That's good, man. I like it. You don't have to say that because the camera's there. there. No, I, I genuinely like it. I think it's really solid. Again, how are you going to button it up, though? You gotta find a way to kind of bring it back and to kind of giving them two options of, of asking. All right, how are you feeling uh, time-wise? I mean, it's, it's 11, 11 and a half. 11 and a half? And you haven't started filming. That's right, I got this, man. Well, I'll let you keep going, but that would be definitely my notes. Just just always think, how is this relating to the challenge? Okay. Keep right. it up, man. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank Today went well, our challenge consisted of creating uh, an ugly truth. I didn't have too many shots, I didn't have to go outside or anything. It's just a simple vlog, like in a hallway, and I only used one actress. Never judge a book by its cover. Jesus, Mom, why not I tell you about vlogging with my camera? Still waiting on the music room. I think I get in there about 30 minutes from now. Really confident about my idea. I think that uh, I've got a great story to tell. Hopefully the judges will agree. It's tough to get a read on them though, so we'll see what happens. I need you to play dentist for me. Is that okay? Totally. You look like a great dentist. So I worked with Megan today, and uh, we did cutaway from her vlog. Where's the 
Brace yourself. <laughs> yeah, perfect, perfect. Running around for a little bit, trying to get all my cutaways, because for some reason I wanted like 17. Whoa, I totally did not just go out of the girls' bathroom with my pants down. What? We were filming a YouTube video. Yeah, man. I worked super briefly with the Shield Brothers, which was friggin' awesome because it was all musical. It's complicated. I can't explain it. Just can't seem to let you go because I'm addicted to you. They were awesome. I told them he reminded me of David Cook, which was a compliment. I think I did a lot of sex. You like a chocolate cherry sprinkle with cocaine? Sex. I need to feel your sugar running through my veins. Sex. They were fun. And they were listening to some of this stuff. Like, there was one moment we saw, like, we shouldn't be in your frame. And they took that, and they're like, you're right, you shouldn't be in our frame. Because they wanted us to jump into their frame. I heard you guys might be doing a little bit of reshoot. What's going on? Have you created the differences, or? We actually shot a bunch and completely scrapped it. And then we shot uh, the whole place. thing again yeah, in a different better. location. Oh, we were just, we just feeling there. It was just very stiff, and there was lots of people everywhere. It's like, and camera usually, crews. we need to, like, <laughs> loosen up. Yeah, we're, like, performers. Yeah, so, yeah. Like, we need to loosen up. So we actually yeah. came back out here and shot oh, over again, and we just, we're almost done. Yeah. We're about to sing our last song. If you want. Oh, yeah, I this definitely want to stay. You're the only reason. I'm sorry, I messed it up. He, he, I saw him in the thing. And <laughs> walk with me, come walk with me, I did plan to finish early today. Started at 9, and I was done by 12. 30. I haven't had any problems with the judging so far on my submission video. They didn't even point anything out that was wrong. They just sort of like praised me about it. I'm actually done with all my footage for today, which is pretty cool. Well, how are you feeling right now in terms of time? I'm feeling great. I'm actually gonna eat lunch today. Oh, you're gonna eat lunch? So, you're yeah. gonna eat lunch break. Gotham City needs me. Need a hero. Da -da 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 -da. Black man. I had this moment where I'm like, oh yeah, just, just you know, rant. And I ramble pretty well. <laughs> she gets going. And I was like getting heated, and I didn't know I was getting heated until like later we were watching it, and I'm like, oh, I'm so angry. Why didn't you guys stop me? And her rant goes on for a while in this <laughs> video too. So it's like, just so good. We have never vlogged before. There are contestants out there that this is their thing, this is what they do, and they're probably really gonna own it. And that's kind of nerve wracking. We hope that our different style will actually, in its own different way, please the judges. Hopefully. I am Matthias, and I have big ears. Yep, said it, it's out there. And they're out there too. Concept wise, considering you know last night came in the bottom two. Yes, um, I'm feeling, feeling this one's that? much stronger. This one is me. It's me. So last night was pretty brutal. All of the judges pretty much unanimously didn't like my stuff. You went from one of my favorite videos, the entry videos, at least top two for me, and it was in the bottom today. As far as Anthony Ma going home, I felt really down after he went home because I. I wasn't sure if I should have gone home or if he should have gone home. If he wasn't late, it, would I have gone home? I worked with Matthias, which was very interesting. He was kind of a one-man show there, and he seemed a little nervous and very much a perfectionist. One more time, I just want to make sure I get it mm -hmm. on the mic, so because you said it when you turned that way. He's interesting. He was. He seemed a little in his head about everything. Yeah, they didn't like it. Uh, so I'm going to redeem myself today. It sounds like he was trying to really make up for what the mistakes that he made last uh, week. I'm proud of this video, and to be honest, I put it on my channel. It's me. I put it on my channel. When I came into this thing, I had a completely different expectation. Yeah? I knew that there were going to be time constraints. Had no idea how difficult really? the game would be. Yeah. Still waiting on the music room. How are you feeling? right now is a one-man show. I mean, it's just it's out of your It's really hard. Zone. It's completely different. Wow. I have to I have to be behind the camera to set focus and to set aperture and ISO, and I also have to be in front of the camera and make these judges laugh. That's one, two, three. And what I've quickly realized is that comedy doesn't always trump everything else. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's interesting, the heartstrings. Right? Yeah. So today's vlog comes from a very personal story of mine. I started editing around noonish. There was a lot of noise out in the editing suite. There were people um, doing loud vlogging and rappings and singing songs. Um, so it was really nice to be able to shut the door and yeah. uh, have a little bit of sanctuary. We also got our coffee today. We forgot our filters at home. Huge mistake. We're from New York. We drink a lot of coffee. Uh, dire, dire. Greg hasn't even had a cup. We've been up since 5 a.m. So. He's about to get in the editing trance. We're gonna hook him up with a little, uh, Clune's magic. Who do I think is going home tonight? You trying to make me start some drama? Watermelon Will. 
sorry to have to say that. The day he just sort of came and sort of like discombobulated out of it. And uh, by like 12.30, I'm done exporting my video. He was just sort of like writing in a notebook. I know, everybody's like editing already. Screw you guys. I kind of like this video. I mean, I showed it to uh, a few of the other contestants and they're really like... Dude, I love it. Great, dude. Damn. Yes. It's good to see that side of you, Will. Thanks, man. It's good writing. And I hope it's not just like a kind of a shock value thing. Like, what? Will, it has a soft side to him. That's Thank cool. You. That's good. You should go shoot that. Yeah. Right now. <laughs> yeah. All right. Next exporting, yeah, finished. Uh, all my clips finished. Every single video that I had to do. It's pretty easy. The time is 12:31. Am I calling myself an overachiever? No. Yes, I'm being modest. Hopefully, it goes well and it works out. Ryan is probably a no. I, I feel I don't know why, but I feel like no. Christine might like it a little bit, but I think Tim will really feel on this one just because of the uh, the, the multisyllabics that I used to rhyme on the words and. I really worked on that flow kind of thing. Uh, I mean, you know, five hours, kind of short, but hopefully they like it. What about those lonely nights holding tight a woven white pillowcase between his arms in a bed which was once filled with excitement? I edited through lunch. Apparently everyone ate everything, so I was out of luck. But this guy right here was like, have a taco, and now it's all good. Feeling all right? I feel good now, okay. yes. I basically sat and did nothing for a few hours as Peter uh, edited the project, and uh, I did a couple graphics that took five minutes, uh, half of which we didn't use. I'm just watching my computer screen clearing up space on my computer, but we'll be all right. It was, it was stressful though. Just listening to my daughter right now, I'm not even editing. But... We are absolutely not stressed out today. That's awesome. I have no idea what the judges will think, but I'm hoping we'll, we'll be in that pass group again, like we were yesterday. Safe. I know we aren't gonna be the best Average. video. No. I'm just doing my little editing here. Got a lot of footage, got a lot to do. Honestly, don't know if I'm gonna get lunch again but uh, I'm really hungry. <laughs> so I'm just in here hanging out with the Clunes. I mean, they have a comfortable couch <laughs> and a lot of cool stuff in here. I know the feeling of victory on the show is, is very sweet, but it also comes with a price. The feeling in the moment is excitement. There's like a little shiver up your spine of like, oh, we got it, we got it. But um, upon going home and, and being exhausted, there's the feeling of we gotta follow this up. We don't right. wanna fall off and have a one hit wonder. Right. We wanna come back with another video that we feel great about. I thought I was doing good, and then I got to my computer and realized my final cut was not opening. My final cut crashed on my computer, yeah. and it just won't open at all. And I was like, I don't know what to do. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to bring a different computer. It was insane, and I kind of had a panic attack, but I tried not to tell anybody because I was going to probably have a mini breakdown if I couldn't open it. I was having this glitch over and over and over again. I pulled up the project and it was just, it was, and this is, this is the sequence. I was like, yeah. what the f This is 30 seconds of the take that I need. Yeah. You know, it's, it's intense. Are you, are you pretty quick at it? I'll finish Ever, it. It's or? not gonna be the product that I want though. I will never wait for the music room again though. That killed me today. The music room stressed you out. Yeah. Huh? We gotta make that sound better. <laughs> Maybe turn on the blacks in these, but I don't know if you have time Turn for down the blacks? Yeah, because it looks a little bit flat. See how this is like, the black is really sharp. Oh. I see what you're saying. Just some fancy just color correcting. Filming, and you can I pretend you're a filmmaker. <laughs> Except this shot, this one's terrible. I think there, there was one thing that bothered me in here, and it was just such a minor thing. You see? Oh, okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. So I have 57 minutes left, and normally I would think that I would do so well at this challenge because this is my forte. I vlog all the time. However, for some random reason, my final cut is not working. Got to pull my hair out. You guys all seem pretty chilled out right now. I mean, I know you're just pretty chilled out dudes, which is awesome. Uh, in terms of trying to keep that cool vibe, this is a chaotic environment. It's about obstacles and challenges. Man, this is our opening shot, so. Son of a <laughs> We're trying to just be as, like, as possible. <laughs> Dude, chips. 
there's times when it's gonna get frantic and crazy, but you gotta keep your head the whole yeah. time. So yeah. Definitely excited to see what you guys come up with tonight. So, so are we. Yeah, yeah check totally back okay. in three hours. Uh, might be a different story. <laughs> yeah. It's 2.14, you're still cutting. I just finished filming, actually, my last just shot. Just filming? <laughs> yeah. Last insert? Pretty much. So if you are planning on being on season three, do not be like me. I am stressing out. I'm pretty sure when I go home, I'm going to have 12 gray hairs. Oh, man. And oh. not on my head. <laughs> just kind of incorporate what I was telling you earlier about making sure you hit those points. Yeah, you know, like uh, reiterate. That's actually what I'm doing in the end right now. It wouldn't even open. Like, I'm like, yay, you finished shooting all my shots. Put it in, and I'm like sitting there for like three minutes, and it's just like loading, Can loading, Can you reinstall loading. it? I was going to probably have a mini breakdown if I couldn't open it. So I finally just resorted to iMovie and I hadn't used iMovie in forever. But I retaught myself, I guess, today. It's not anywhere near the quality that I would like to put out. Yeah. I really think I could go home tonight, like, no joke. Because uh, my video was, it's not my usual stuff. It was something that I wasn't really comfortable with and it was a real big gamble. I'm going for a slam poetry approach. Uh -huh. And this is actually the first time I've ever written slam poetry. Really? Yes. Yeah, so they know you're a great blogger. You have personality, you have charisma, you know how to put together a great, funny blog. This is something they haven't seen you do before. And I think that's important for your audience to know. Uh, as well as, I think it's, it's part of who you are, so it's great that you're sharing it. That's the whole reason YouTube is so cool, is that we get to really, we get to know these personalities that we follow. So, yeah. I think it's awesome, man. Thank you. Yeah, you should be proud. Yeah, baby. They think they're weird, but they're not. They're so relatable because everyone is weird, you know? It's just like, those guys are really, they're on point. They're on point with what they do. I'm actually gonna use my next 31 minutes to uh, beg the clones to let me be an honorary clone member. <laughs> an honorary clone, I love it. So, you already are, man. You already are. I, yeah, I gotta make coffee for them real fast. Right. <laughs> the clones, they said my video is really good, and if I lose, they're gonna go on strike. So, don't send me home. You can't talk right. during the recording. We don't have that much time. What time is it? I don't think we're doing it right. You did it again. You right. just did it again. It's like 10 seconds of recording. All right. Alrighty. All right, we're done. No Thank God. People like to go over dramatic, and we realize that we can't run. I was. Whoa! Whoa. Hello, my friend. Matthias. Yeah, man, down the land. Bad weather film? Yeah. Shamalama. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, we, we have an exported one. You have a no. backup copy. Yeah. Let's uh, get down there. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, they're stickers. <laughs> Wait, right? You go downstairs. Yeah. Cutting the clothes, boys. Oh, All right. We thought it was like 50%. Now it's like... Booyah! 30 seconds oh, to spare. Man. Good job, everybody. Everybody turned it in on time. Coming up on the next Internet Icon. Yeah, I kind of hate you because it was so good. You know, you're speaking to the right audience here. So when did you write this? Uh, when I got here. Well, I'll tell you what, we're not feeling too good about tonight. Yeah. Fix the... Audio. It's not okay anymore to have a good video. You have to have an excellent video. How are we gonna win this thing? Truth brings you the facts behind the tobacco industry and other issues that matter to you. That's why they're bringing you exclusive behind the scenes videos, uncovering all of the secrets and fun from season two. Check out the internet icon playlist at www.youtube.com slash truth orange. So Sam, are you more the editor in this situation? That's Peter. Oh, sorry, Peter. She doesn't know my name. <laughs> You're not gonna throw one dollar bills at you. You know that, right? Do you want me to do that? Like, I feel like right now you're, you're all right, here we go. Sell my soul. You got it. Cameraception. Hey, Internet. Hey, my name's Chris. And I'm Nick. Together, we're the brothers right now. Yeah, we are. I'm hosting season two of Internet Icon. And I'm mentoring it. Yes. <laughs> we know you guys are tenacious fans, and we love you, and we love hearing from you, but guess what? We want more. We want to see you. We're inviting you to play along from home. 
and do your own versions of any of the season two challenges. And leave them here as video responses in the comments below. You're welcome to do as many as you would like for as many of the challenges that we throw at our top contestants. At the end of the season, we will pick the top fan video and play it live during the finale. So put your camera where your mouth is. And put your face where your words go. And do the challenges yourself. And maybe your video will be on the live finale of Internet Icon season two. Right here on the Yum Yum F Network. <laughs> That's so a like, good name for a, band. for a band. We should do yeah. not tell the shields. No, don't tell the shields. Yum, yum, F.